Hey everybody, welcome back to a brand new release preview video. Today we have 2020 Elite Extra Edition. This just came out on Wednesday and showed up retail-wise at many Walmarts yesterday and today. So we've got two blaster boxes with two hits per box and we have a hobby box with eight autographs and two memorabilia cards. We're looking at a grand total of 14 hits from just these three boxes today. This is our first video of the day, by the way. We've got a double upload day. We also have a whole bunch of boxes of Bowman Draft Sapphire, which we will be opening up a little bit later in another new release preview video. Those just showed up at my doorstep literally uh, about five minutes before I was ready to come down here and film this video. So we got a double upload day for you. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Also, if you're not yet subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button. We'd love to have you along for all of our videos. There's also a little bell next to the subscribe button. If you tap that and click all, you'll get all of our post notifications for any time we post a video or go live. Looking to go live tomorrow with a case break of this product tomorrow night, Saturday. So hope you can join us for that. So let's go ahead and get started to talk a little bit about this product. We have blaster boxes, which I found these at Walmart uh, today, actually, and they are $20 a piece. You only get five cards in the entire box, but four of those cards, or actually two of those cards are going to be hits. We're going to have four total hits from those two blaster boxes. Uh, I found in the past from Elite Extra Edition, it's usually like one autograph, one relic, but sometimes you might have a relic with an auto on there, so you could get two autographs. And this is the uh, the big boy. This is the hobby box. These are selling on eBay right now, looking at the sold listings for about $108 to $110 per box before tax. Uh, and the big, uh, the big draw there is eight autographs and two memorabilia cards. So let's go ahead and get started with this video and start pulling the hits out. We'll do the blaster boxes first. By the way, our sponsor for this video is Mr. Michael Nichols. Michael, thank you very much. Hope we get some good autographs for you. We're going to be seeing a lot of top prospects from the 2020 draft. Hopefully we can find some nice Torkelsons or Kerstads in here. Now that I have this unwrapped, we'll take a look at it. You can see Austin Martin is there. We'll also we'll see some Dominican Prospect League autographs and cards in here. There is two Blaster exclusive pink parallels per box. And there is all the uh, fine print on the side if you are interested in that. So let's go ahead and see. There's just one pack in here. There it is. One lonely pack. That's it. So let's see what we've got. Michael, best of luck to you. If you'd like to become a Patreon member and participate in videos just like this one, it's $3 per month. You can check the link in the description to this video. we got a Levi Prater as our first card. That's, that's the pink. we got our second pink. It's going to be a Maximo Acosta. And here's our first hit. It is Milan Tolentino, and that's going to be an 18U USA material relic. So one hit is in the books, and the second hit is going to be a David Calavrese on-card auto. Nice one right there. Like that one. Uh, card number 82 on the back. So the number there on the back tells you kind of where they went. Uh, so he was probably like a third-rounder. Uh, which isn't too bad. Number one card in the set is obviously Torkelson, who was the number one overall pick, number two, Kerstad. We'll take it. Michael, thank you very much. There's your Aaron Baracho as well. Let's check out your other blaster and see what we can find. Blaster number two. Kind of expensive, 20 bucks for just five cards. I went out looking for some more Topps Holiday today. Didn't see any, but I did see lots of this on the shelves. So um, eh, not the most popular product but amongst those that like prospects uh this is right up their alley there's a cole wilcox from the uh, collegiate national team his game use jersey and we have a dominican players league card here it is a christian santana autograph as our second one i don't know much about him at all i don't know if it gives us his age or anything like that but it does say that he does have some giddy up which uh so i guess we'll see what becomes of him might Take a few years, of course. Felix Coates is the last one. So now it's time to get into the big boy of the video. It's the uh, hobby box with eight autographs total in here. Let's see what we can pull out of this. Kind of a prospect day on the channel, I guess, with Bowman Draft Sapphire coming up a little bit later. I'll give you a quick little walk around the box. They're also advertising the exclusive Dominican Prospect League on card autos. There's the back for those of you that like to read through that. You can always, I guess, pause it if you wanted to. The, I feel like the Panini fine print is less interesting to read than the Topps fine print. I like how Topps gives you all the in-depth odds and everything. All right, so here we go. Open it up. 
can see this is what the box art looks like in case you're wondering a pack of these is probably going to cost you about 20 to 25 bucks at your lcs if you just want to go for one pack and uh, the nice thing about it is it seems like every pack's probably going to have at least one hit since there's eight hits per box some of the packs are going to feel a little thicker because there's going to be a relic in there uh, let's see what we can find in michael's first pack up so we have ourselves a christian roa and we have a die cut card it's a by the way that all the base cards i believe are going to be numbered in the uh, regular set that's out of 999 freddie zamora out of 39 i think yeah milwaukee brewers pulled some of his autos out of bowman draft and look at this we have a spencer torkelson hit is it going to be an autograph it's a it's a relic Game use relic Spencer Torkelson. That's still not bad. Not bad at all. We'll take it. A Torkelson first round materials. If you're going to get a relic, you might as well get the uh, the most valuable player in the draft in the set. Torkelson, the number one overall pick in 2020. We pulled one of his autos out of 499 out of the Jabs family box for December in the uh, preview video for that. And that card's like a thousand dollar card now. So nice one right there. I don't know what this one is worth, Michael. Probably at least, I, I'm, I would guess about 20 bucks on that. Esteban Floreal, New York Yankees is going to be your autograph. Nice one right there. We've been seeing his cards the past couple of years. Prospect in the Yankees system, hidden gems. I don't think he's that hidden. I knew about him. So he's, uh, he's, his name's out there in Tyler Soderstrom from the Oakland Athletics. Great looking card right there is the last one. So one out of five packs in the book. We have two out of ten hits. This pack feels pretty thin. I'm guessing there's going to be an autograph and no relic in here. Let's see what we've got. Maybe two autographs. That's the thing about buying just loose packs. Um, somebody could feel that and be like, well, that pack's really thin. There's probably two autographs, and I think I'll buy that one. That's why I'd always just advise just buying the whole box we got a jordan walker of 9.99 a dax fulton and we are going to get two autographs i do believe the first is going to be the 46th overall pick and the 36th gage workman from the detroit tigers that's a nice one right there i always get him confused with torkelson when i'm looking through bowman draft because their cards are kind of similar nice auto for michael and tanner burns is the second one on card auto out of 215 cleveland indians the indians are going to need all the help they can get they have a uh, a less than a $40 million payroll, so we'll see how fast Burns gets up to the big leagues. He's still great players, Jose Ramirez, Shane Bieber, Zach Plezak. We'll see what becomes of them, though. But the uh, AL Central is up for the taking. There's an RJ Dabovich out of 215. All right, so pack number three feels like a two autograph pack again because it's very thin. Let's see what we can find for you in our next one. There's a Brady Lindsley out of 999 as the first card. Oh, how about this one? That would be nice to pull an auto of this guy. It's a Jason Dominguez Pulse insert card. Check the back of that one. Great looking card right there. Of course, Jason Dominguez, uh, one of the hottest young prospect names out there right now for the Yankees. Congrats on that one, Michael. And you might have a Casey Mize autograph or it might be a relic. We'll see. First up, you got a Zach Deloke, which is a nice one right there from the Seattle Mariners on card auto. And here it is, Future Threads, Casey Mize. Oh, it's a Casey Mize autograph. Very nice. I thought you were just going to have a relic, but this guy is going to be an absolute beast. Within the next couple of years, everybody seems to think Casey Mize is going to be an ace. Uh, lots of people in Detroit are really pumped up about their future. you got Casey Mize, who's going to be the ace of your rotation. You're going to have Torkelson there, mashing dingers over the next uh, – probably get there in a year or two. He's got to be pretty close since he's coming from college. But that is a pretty nice one right there. Casey Mize, love it. Congratulations on the auto relic there, Michael. Very nice card. And Jack Blomgren out of 499 is the last one. So that Mize is probably going to be the best card of the box, but – We've got two more packs left before we get on out of here. Again, later tonight, we'll have Bowman Draft Sapphire. The uh, Everybody loves Sapphire, so if you do love top, and all the top Sapphire releases, check us out for the Bowman Draft first. We'll be looking for more Torkelsons and Kerstads and all these prospects. There's a Heston Kerstad out of 999 Base card, we also got an Evan Carter. And here's my guy, probably my favorite pirate now, since there's not too much left. On the team, Josh, I, I really like Josh Bell. Now he's gone. We got Key Brian Hayes, and that is out of 199. It's a prospect materials relic there. He was the uh, rookie of the month for September, which is basically the rookie for half of the year in the National League. Nice one right there. Key Brian Hayes out of 199. Son of Charlie Hayes. A lot of you guys know Charlie Hayes from his days with the Yankees and Phillies and such. There's A.J. Vukovic. From the Arizona Diamondbacks. Nice die cut card. Numbered out of 24 right there. 
He was looks like he was the 126th pick of the draft, if I'm not mistaken. Jose De Jesus is last one out of 249. We're down to our final pack of this preview video. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. Hope you will hit that thumbs up and the subscribe button. And again, I'll probably get the uh, Bowman Draft Sapphire video up for you tonight between 9 p.m. and 10 p.m. Eastern. I'll give you guys a few hours to watch this one. All right, so we've got Henry Ramos as our first card. Andrew Jones, or not Andrew Jones, Jared Jones. Andrew Jones, of course, is the uh, longtime center fielder for the Braves. Ben Hernandez is going to be the autograph there. Nice one right there. Number 40, card number 41. And Owen Cassie is the final one. And it's a low number out of eight. Nice die cut out of eight. One thing about the die cuts, though, they're, the corners of these are always so tough to keep. Even, like, coming out of the, the box, there's, like, a... I won't say rounded, but a, not a perfect corner coming right out of the pack. So Owen Cassie is the last card, last auto, and Garrett Crochet out of 218. Nice one right there is our last card. So, Michael, thank you very much. Thank you to all of you guys for watching. Again, it's called 2020 Elite Extra Edition. They do have that retail version that you saw. We opened two of those boxes. Those are $20 for just those five cards. Maybe you'll get a hit. Uh, you're you're going to get a hit, but maybe you'll hit it big. Maybe, uh, maybe you won't, but... Uh, they're fun to try, especially if you like your prospects. So later tonight, everybody, once again, we have Bowman Draft Sapphire. This is an exclusive that you can only get through uh, the 582 Montgomery Club. Although I guess a couple boxes did make it on the top's main website, and they sold out within like a minute or so. So we'll be opening that a little bit later. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. Hope you guys have a great rest of your Friday. I hope to see you later. Good night, everybody.